guys. Wow! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Awesome! Look at this! Wow! Can I see your another experiment, Uncle, with different color? Yeah? One more coin, please. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, so cool! So fun! Ooh. More, 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 more! Huh? More toys! Huh? No more! Then no more experiments, sorry! Oh! the tornado experiments? Yeah, they're so cool. A tornado experiment? Hmm. Ah. Hmm? Ah, I got it. Ah, finished. All done. Tornado machine. Yeah! So cool. But Auntie, can you make a tornado with bottles? Huh? Uh, sorry. I don't know how. Uncle Mike did it. We really want to know how. Hmm. <laughs> Let's learn how to do it together. Okay, Auntie. Ahaha! I got it. And remember, always do science experiments with parental supervision. We need two bottles, one is half full of water, and then a connector. Whoa. First, flip it upside down, shake it around. Voila, look at that. Wow. Auntie, Auntie, can I try it? Sure. How does it work, Auntie? Why does it have a tornado in the water? Just like a tornado, the water moves in a circular motion. This is called the centripetal force. It's then pulled down, creating a vortex, and then we see a tornado. Whoa, I learned a lot today. How are we going to make a colorful tornado? Only adults can do this part, but we use lamp oil. Hmm, interesting. We use a funnel. Now we pour the oil into the bottle. Now we're ready. learned a lot today. <laughs> wow. awesome. Bye. Can you fix it, Alex? I'm late for work. Yeah, sure. I'm the best scientist. I can fix it in one second. All done. Try it. Okay. Wait, hold on, Alex. It's not working. Huh? Let me double check. It still doesn't work, Alex. I'm gonna be late. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I forgot to give you this. This is the on button. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Yes, it's working. Uh, uh, Bye. Uh, 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 Goodbye. I'm the best scientist. Ooh. Alex, Alex. What happened, Auntie? Can you help me with my science project? Sure, I'm the best scientist. What do you need? When I turn the bottle upside down, I need the ping pong ball to hold the water. I'm the best scientist, I can do it. Uh-oh. Whoa, what happened here? I'm asking the best scientist to help me with my project. Huh? He's my student. Sorry, just kidding. That's okay, can you help me? I need the ping pong to keep the water in the bottle when I turn it upside down. Yeah, sure, let me show you. First, you have to squeeze the water bottle. Then you turn it upside down with the ping pong ball under it. 
Then you slowly let go, and the suction will keep the ping pong ball in place. Cool! Whoa, that's amazing! Can I try? Sure, give it a shot. First you have to squeeze it, put it upside down, let go, and... It works! Yay! Remember, always do science experiments with adult supervision. It's like magic, Uncle! Can you show me more ping pong ball experiments? Sure! Take your plastic cup, your ping pong ball, put them together. Not so high, right? Now you take some water and you shake it a little bit, then you add your ping pong ball. Now, you gotta back up, because there's a lot of splash going on here. Whoa! Now that's some distance. Now let me show you our ping pong ball trick using straws. Straws? Wow! <gasps> How did you do it? You need to take a deep breath, then a steady stream of air when you blow out. Let me try, Uncle. Go ahead. Awesome! You helped me a lot today, scientists. I learned a lot too! Now, let's do a competition. Alright, whoever's ball goes the highest, wins. You ready? Three, two, one, drop! Congratulations, Uncle! You won! Yeah! Now remember guys, patience is the key. If you fail, try, try again! Bye!